All right, everybody. Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Irene and today I am building an L shaped house. Um, this wasn't my first choice per se. I kind of wanted to build like a zigzag Z type of house, but then I thought it would be kind of fun to do an L shaped house. So here we are building an L shaped house. Um, you know, I started off with a very skinny L and then I did kind of expand it out and everything. And I think as fun as this house was, it did have its challenges. Also, by the way, I only used base game, um, so it is very accessible to everybody. I put it on the gallery afterwards, and then you can see here I'm moving it around because I didn't know where I wanted to place the backyard, but I did know that I wanted it to be more behind the house, but it looks different in the gallery, but I just go based off of like the sidewalk and everything that I can see because I liked the fact that the pond was back there um, because I debated on putting a pond in this build but i didn't uh, because there was the pond back there also just so you guys know i do love this lot quite a bit um this lot is one of my favorite lots it's a new crest don't know the exact name of it but i do really like this lot a lot because of no pun intended sorry i just realized i said a lot a lot um but i do like it because it one, it gets good light. Two, it's just like a good size lot. So if you started with some things um, a little bit smaller and built it out, you definitely have the space. And then you can see here, I did leave that like other part out. Like after I put the rectangle, I left that like actual part where you make the L out because I wanted to make that um, a more outdoor space. I did on my console i did do a build like this it wasn't as l-shaped it was a little bit more of a i guess like a u-shaped because it didn't have the space for the size for a z-shaped essentially um i was trying to recreate like my house like my one of my childhood homes and i couldn't necessarily get the shape down because i really wanted to use this particular lot but it didn't work with that because i didn't like the way that it did the yard space then so I did that though, but I created like part of the outside space as, or um, part of the L space as like outside space. So I like what I end up doing with that. And I don't know, I just, it got me really excited. But the thing with this is like with these builds are, I am not a builder, you guys. Like I, I know I looked at the end of this and I saw the fact that like the windows were misaligned. I thought I put them in the correct spot, but it, turns out that I actually had not. So I end up putting everything correctly, you know, after, of course, after I finished recording instead of when I finished recording. Um, so it, it is what it is, but I, everything should be correct in the gallery now. And I do really love how this house turned out. I'm not going to lie to you. I just... I try building a lot and I feel like it never turns out the way I exactly want it. And not that I plan to go in here doing an L shaped. I actually plan to go in doing like a Z shape because that was more accurate to the childhood home that I had a home that I had. Okay. That was weird. I don't know why I can't speak today, you guys. Um, but yeah, so I put it, I wanted to do that. I actually built something similar to that on my console, but it didn't turn out as well. So there was that, you know, but I really liked the way this turned out because I think it's fun. It's different for me. I did only use base game. I don't know if you guys will notice throughout the video, but I did only use base game, which I think is to me, it's important because as somebody who played console for years, like I had the Sims 4 when it came out, I remember going to Best Buy to buy it um, because I don't know, I didn't have like someone's PlayStation password, so I couldn't like buy it through the PlayStation, so I had to go and get the disc. Uh, not that I minded though. I mean, I was so happy. I, you know, I just like got my license. So I was driving to Best Buy, I bought it. I was so excited. The guy had gone in the back for me, which is like the only time I will say someone has ever gone in the back and returned with something. As someone who worked retail for years, we used to use that trick just to shut people up. Um, not saying that that happens all the time. That specifically though was for this man. Um, he was like, yeah, it's in the back. Let me just go grab it for you real quick. Like he checked on his like little, whatever, like scanner thing that they have that they can look things up on. Um, it's like a pin pad, whatever. Anyway, not the point. Point being that they, you know, 
they had that and I bought it and I was so excited and you know I didn't have any packs it was just like the complete base game but it was my favorite thing in the world and I just I was so excited to play and I know that they have the free holiday stuff um, where they come with like a Christmas tree and presents so I used to like pretend that you know we had Christmas because this was honestly even before seasons came out um, and then I really liked the house in the desert in um what's it called you guys it's not Delso Valley the, the the like base game desert I can't think of the name right now um but i really like that also this lot i don't know if i've said it i might have said it um i really like this lot in the sims 4 this is one of my favorite lots it's a new crest and i don't know i just think it's a really good lot i think new crest i know a lot of people complain about how much space we have to build and everything i think new crest needs to be taken advantage of more um and i understand i'm not the builder right i'm not the builder so people don't necessarily like um like newcrest because they probably used all of it not like it but they've probably built all over newcrest and everything so they're probably ready for something else too i again as someone who doesn't build a lot love it and i'm currently actually trying to work through filling up newcrest so i think this is like the third or fourth house that i've put in newcrest um but that will be kind of a series that i have on the channel not necessarily like, like super outright but um definitely something that i will continue to do and i'll you know i'll show you guys and everything it'll be a playlist on my channel if you guys want to look through it but especially like as i get more packs as i do more things i definitely want to do this i want to build more i want to do more things i want to do a lot with just base game just because i want to show people that you can just use the base game um because i know a lot of people feel bad that they can't like buy all the packs and you shouldn't i mean it stinks like i love certain packs like i love the sulani pack island living i always call it the sulani pack for some reason though but yeah also i don't know if you guys watched because i was just watching um myself really struggle with the island i don't know why i struggled with it so much i think it's because i wanted to move it but then i didn't move it correctly or i didn't use like the right counters regardless though i really like the kitchen where it is i think it's like a good spot and then eventually you'll see towards the end of the video i do put like a door there not like a door i put a door there um and i think it works really well just because it's what i really wanted for that i wanted to have like a way out instead of going all the way around but i really at the end of the day love this house and it's one of my favorite builds i think i've ever done because there is one build and i can't remember where it was i can't remember if it was sims 3 or sims 4 but it was like one of my favorite houses okay so i did look and it is sims 4 um i actually <laughs> i was still playing my console yesterday because i was watching my dog and he's in the living room i don't want him in my room he pissed me off yesterday he ate my airpods don't want to talk about it um but so whatever so he ate my airpods so i was in the living room and then he um what do you call it he was with me i was watching him playing my console but i just remember because i wanted to go and check i looked and it is on the sims 4 i had built it it's one of because i built it as more of like a witchy house because i wanted that generation to be what do you call it i wanted them to be spell casters so that's why i wanted like a more witchy vibe and because i have the cottage living pack in this um and on my pc i want to do a cottage core one because i love the cottage living pack that's also one of my favorite packs um i just think it's so much fun it's so it's like so sweet and cute and you know you can have all the little animals and there's something about simple living that is just superior i did do it for a recent um save file so i'm very excited also you guys i will finish the challenge this week uh, again it's just been i don't know if i told you guys but it's been a crazy week unfortunately my grandfather passed and getting back in the swing of things has not been the easiest thing in the world to do i have had a kind of a difficult time but you know i do like creating things because i feel as if it makes me closer to um people that have passed like whether it be like writing or something it just makes me it kind of like lets me have my outlets anyway not the point point being though that I 
will finish that challenge because it's been on the back of my mind and I kind of just want to get it done. I'm very close to finishing it. I actually want to try the challenges more. I think I've said it a hundred times before and I'm sure I said it in that video, but I do want to do the challenges more because I feel like they're a lot of fun and they're not something people do often. I know people usually do it when like a new challenge comes out or something, but I don't feel like they're done as often as others. Anyway, I'm on the upstairs now and I realized I don't know how to decorate a bedroom. Just because I'm like, I feel like there's so many, I don't like useless things in The Sims. And I know how bad that sounds, but I don't like things that um, you can't use like to decorate. So I did realize that I don't like doing things that I can't or like putting things in the house that I can't use also I don't know if you guys saw but I do spend like if I decorate I spend a lot of time decorating so it's just like it takes up so much of my time which I think is why I stopped doing it and I don't want to decorate because they take too much time also I don't like using things that are useless so there's that however again I love this house and how it turns out um, and I'm very excited for that L part right I can't I can't you guys can't see me pointing but like right where the um, where the bedroom is that's like not covered by like wall I really like what I ended up doing with that too because I really wanted something like fun and different I can't remember if I said that already you guys I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself but yeah yeah, and then you definitely see me kind of struggle to like figure out what to do with like all the empty space and that's where I guess like the useless things that I don't like come into play, but go figure. Anyway, but yeah, okay, and I'll let you guys finish the build. I do like what I also end up doing. Okay, outside is also really hard for me. Side note, um, I know I said I was going to be a stop talking now, but outside is really really hard for me to figure out for some reason i mean inside is like one thing i'm like oh yeah they can do x y and z activity but oh yeah actually never mind i'm not shutting up um <laughs> i do love what i do here i think it's super cute i did this with a build once and i don't know why it was like my favorite thing i think just because it adds like a little bit it, it adds some characters to the house and they can plant their like little garden and everything so it's fun I like it and I hope you guys like it too and I hope you like what's done with the backyard and it's on the gallery and yeah let me know if you want to see any other builds soon all right please make sure to like subscribe tell your friends tell your mom tell your dad tell your dog um and yeah leave me any suggestions you want to see builds all right thanks bye